hold on tight, adrenaline junkies and film buffs alike, as Baby Driver 2 races onto the silver screen. Prepare to hit the gas pedal and immerse yourself in a high-octane world of music, action and thrilling heists. In this exclusive sneak peek, we bring you the first look at the highly anticipated sequel which is set to take audiences on another electrifying joyride. Be ready to strap in, crank up the volume and go on another wild ride with Baby in Baby Driver 2. Edgar Wright has revealed that he has finished the first draft of Baby Driver 2, the sequel to his critically acclaimed 2017 heist film starring Ansel Elgert. The original Baby Driver, which was released in 2017, is one of the director's most celebrated works. The film, which received widespread critical acclaim for its creative set pieces that were meticulously edited to music and strong performances, is Alter Wright's highest grossing film by far, grossing $226.9 million. It also received a slew of award nominations, including a Golden Globe nomination for star Ansel Elgert and a spot on the national board of reviews list on the top 10 movies of the year. <laughs> Baby Driver subsequently followed Elgert's young getaway driver, Baby, a music enthusiast and talented driver who struggles with tinnitus as a result of a traumatic childhood incident. Baby falls for waitress Deborah, believing he can flee his life of crime with her. His plans put him at odds with the rest of the criminal crew, causing him and the group to clash. Baby Driver was a passion project for director Edgar Wright that took a long time to develop while he worked on other films. However, Wright recently disclosed that he has conditions for returning to direct a sequel. Given the phenomenal success of Baby Driver, speculation about a sequel became unavoidable. And despite the fact that all of Wright's feature films have been standalone, he has expressed enthusiasm for making Baby Driver 2. At the very least, Wright hoped to write a screenplay for such a film, and it appears he has done so. In an interview with Empire, Wright gave a brief update on the sequel's progress, saying, A first draft of Baby Driver 2 exists. Details are scarce for now, but the script reportedly introduces a slew of new characters and takes the story further. Are you a mute? No. <laughs> So, um, what are you listening to? Uh, music. It's worth noting, however, that Baby Driver 2 isn't going to be Wright's next film. He intends to film a psychological thriller he co-wrote with Christy Wilson Cairns. It's difficult to predict where the sequel will begin because the first Baby Driver told its own story with a distinct beginning, middle, and an ambiguous end. Wright will almost certainly have to answer any remaining questions about the original's ending and show Baby forging a new life for himself, possibly with Deborah by his side. Their sweet old-fashioned romance was a big reason why Baby Driver worked so well, so it would be a shame if fans did not get to see more of it in a sequel. On September 20th, 2021, Edgar Wright stated that he would be willing to direct the follow-up to his 2017 movie Baby Driver if he could make the process enjoyable for himself. Wright's Baby Driver starring Ansel Elgert, Lily James, John Hamm, Aza Gonzalez, Jamie Foxx and John Bernthal follows a young escape driver torn between the love of his life and his career as a criminal. In a conversation with Carrie Fukunaga for Interview Magazine, Fukunaga asked Wright if he felt he would be selling out if he returned for Baby Driver 2. Wright stated that he wanted to make it enjoyable rather than a carbon copy of the original film. Given that a movie takes two years to make, Wright emphasized that he needed to be passionate about the project in order to commit to it. He also said that he and Fukunaga were not afraid to abandon projects if they were not a good fit. Look at the quote from Wright. If I did the sequel, and in fact I've already written a script, I'd have to find a way to make it fun for me. The idea of doing a straight Xerox is just not interesting because, as you know, these films take at least two years, and in our cases, because of the pandemic, they took even longer. My rule of thumb is that you have to really want to do it. We've both been in situations where we walked away from a studio franchise movie because we were not feeling it. I know that we share many things in common and that's one of them. Wright is known as a creative director who is not afraid to experiment with new ideas. For example, his most recent film, Last Night in Soho, is unlike anything he's ever done before, so it stands to reason that he'd only direct Baby Driver 2 if he can make the experience fun and unique for himself. The 
fact that he's already written a script for Baby Driver 2 indicates that he intends to make the film one day, so it'll be interesting to see what happens next. Wright previously stated that if a sequel to Baby Driver was made, he would direct it. Given that Baby Driver was originally an artistic endeavor for Wright, it's no surprise that he'd like to return to the world and characters he created. Despite Wright's previous enthusiasm, a possible sequel may have become jeopardized due to multiple allegations involving many of the actors involved, including actor at the lead Ansel Elgert. Wright also has a few other projects in the works, including a remake of Running Man and an adaptation of the horror novel The Chain. Depending on how these go in the future, Baby Driver 2 may have to be put on hold. It's far from a confirmation, but Wright has mentioned the possibility of a Baby Driver sequel once more. Wright teased the possibility of a sequel in a tweet commemorating the one-year anniversary of Baby Driver's release. On June 8, 2018, Edgar Wright tweeted, Baby Driver was released one year ago today. I've had a wild ride with it in the last 365 days, so I thank you for all your beautiful responses. It means everything, and who knows, maybe he could be back on the road soon. Given the success of Baby Driver, it's easy to see why Sony would want to begin filming a sequel as soon as possible. Wright believes that if he truly wants to sell another story involving the character of Baby, he has every reason to write and direct a sequel. Because the ending of Baby Driver left Baby's fate unclear and open, there are numerous parts Wright could take in the story if he felt compelled to return to that world. Some may argue, on the other hand, that Baby Driver's ending was perfect in its ambiguity and openness, leaving audiences wondering whether Baby truly reunited with his lady love, Deborah, after prison or simply fantasized about getting back together with her. I'm sorry, ma'am. According to these people, making a sequel that definitively answered any questions about Baby's future with or without Deborah would be an insult to the poetry of that ending. Wright, after all, owns the story and the characters, and he has the final say on whether Baby gets another chapter. As of now, it appears Wright is still considering getting back behind the wheel for another spin with Baby. While fans wait for more information on the film's progress, it is clear that Wright approaches the idea of a sequel with the intention of creating a unique and enjoyable experience for both himself and the audience. It will also be fascinating to see how he develops the world of Baby Driver while adhering to its distinctive style because of his commitment to imaginative storytelling and willingness to take chances. That's all there is to it. For the time being, please ensure that you like our video. Please share your thoughts and opinions with us in the comment section. Subscribe to the channel to stay up to date on the newest news and reviews on future films from us and don't forget to hit that bell button to never miss an update. Thanks for taking the time to watch this video and we hope to see you at the next one.